sports fans, and welcome back to another heart-pounding, action-packed game of Brew Bowl, a Blood Bowl 7's tournament proudly sponsored by Bugman 7X. We are in the twilight of Lyman round now, with only tonight's game and one more game to play, but there's still plenty of action in the competition, starting right now with a match I don't think even the most devoted servant of Nuffle could have predicted. These two teams met in round two of the competition last year in a match that was all one-way traffic, but tonight, where both teams are rendered down to only the most basic players, will we see an upset? There's only one way to find out. First off tonight, we welcome back the Norska Marauders. A heart-stopping last-minute touchdown by Lyman's Dog gave the Marauders a 2-1 victory over the Death River Avengers last round and kept the team in playoff contention. There's no doubt that Beastmen make formidable Lyman, and that could certainly prove the, uh, the Marauders, so that could certainly provide the Marauders with a strong advantage here tonight. Facing off against the Marauders, we have last season's champions, the Asquan Gladiators. The Gladiators suffered an upset defeat against the Lauren Forest Drakes last round in a match where they just couldn't seem to stop their opponents from scoring. The Gladiators remain, however, the team to watch this season, but the question will remain, how well can the team do if so many of their star players are forced to sit on the bench? Here to answer this and many other questions tonight, we have both team managers in the Cabal Vision Studios. So let me say welcome to you, Tharsa Mergalad, and welcome to you, Bungo Quickfoot. Oh, thank you, Wilhelm. Bungo Slo uh, Quickfoot, always a pleasure to not see you, but here you are. I'm sorry, who are you again? Nobody important, don't worry. <laughs> Let's, uh, I, I think I've uh, seen you around the, the pitch once or twice before, but uh, I, I don't know. I, I just can't. I have my own booth at place Triple Skull either. Club, so <laughs> that's probably why you don't see me. Let's uh, let's start off with you, Thassa. Uh We've been yeah. discussing the players that each manager has picked as their one position for the match. You have a number of skilled blockers, but you made the decision to bring your Minotaur Minzer, one of the few big guys, to make an appearance this round. Tell me a little about why you decided to bring the ball tonight. Well, Minzer has proven himself to be quite the formidable foe. There might be a pun in there somewhere. Definitely some alliteration. Uh, but anyway, Minzer has proven himself to be very good on the field, uh, despite what some would call a bullish-headed attitude. Um, and we just wanted, we wanted to bring him out because, well, we wanted somebody that we knew was going to pull things off, probably limbs, but pull things off nonetheless. Over to you, Bungo. True fans of the Gladiators will know the injuries in your last round so really limited the options you had for which positional to bring. Your two powerhouse players, Sabi and, of course, Carla Von Kill, were both injured out of contention. That left you with Blitzify Sierra or your throw in a Ripley. I think the choice was clear, but would it have been so clear if not for those injuries? Was there ever a thought that Carla might have been your play tonight? That certainly was a strong possibility, Wilhelm. Uh, you know, but as you said, you know, our options were limited due to injuries uh, suffered against the the Drakes. But, you know, we're going to make the most of it. We have uh, uh, Fisera out there. And, of course, you know, she's the star of the team. And I did consider uh, Neuropoly, but I think, you know, with the particular lineup that we're going against here, it, you know, we definitely are going to need that extra speed that uh, Fisera provides. You know, it, it does come as a sacrifice for our throwing game, but... Uh, We'll see what happens out there. All right, Thassa. It seems to me that the one thing you've got going for, so the one thing you're going to have to contend with this evening is the fact that every single one of those Amazons is slippery, not easy to put on the ground, even when you have the strength advantage. On average, it takes twice as many blocks to put each one down. Have you got a plan tonight for how you throw twice as many blocks? You know, some would say twice as many blocks. I say twice as hard. It's hard to get up when you can't open your eyes. So it's the plan, hit hard then? Hit hard. And if that doesn't work, then we'll go to hit often. Right. Bungo, your opponent's linemen are not too slow, and with these horns, they can be quite dangerous on a blitz against your relatively weakly armored players. What's your plan for ensuring that you keep your full team on the pitch all game in, in order to give the opportunities to score? Yeah, we're definitely going to have to uh, play defensively here. The, again, the horns are going to be an issue. Uh, definitely going to try to put the hurt on the uh, the girls out on the field today. But, uh, you know, despite having uh, a big guy on the team, I think the Marauders here might find that to be a liability. You know, we'll we'll see what happens. We'll see how he behaves. And, of course, you know, I got my uh, my girl Somopoli out there who is uh, not daunted by going up one-on-one uh, -on -one against the big guy. So, in a way, we have a little Carl <laughs> out on the field tonight. Now, I touched on it briefly before, but Thartha, the last time these two teams met was back the last time these two teams met 
was back in round two of the competition last season. In that match, the Gladiators ran away with a 3 0 victory, marking the worst defeat the Marauders have ever suffered. You've obviously come a long way since then. Are you confident that your team has what it takes to avoid that sort of upset for a second time? Oh, absolutely. Uh, one could say that I am in my vengeance era, but I believe that's an outdated phrase. Uh, I prefer to say it as we're going to get our we're going to get our own back tonight. Uh, and Bungo, in the match I just mentioned, there wasn't a single touchdown from your now star blitzer Fisera. Since that match, Fisera has gone on to score eighteen of the twenty nine touchdowns, or sixty two percent of all your points since round two last season. There are some that say that Fisera is now a one-woman team. That, of course, leads to her getting targeted consistently by your opposition. How vital is Fisera to your game plan tonight? Well, she, of course, is the star player of the team. There's no you know, sense denying that. She's got the most skills out there, and she's got the stats to prove it. But the thing that sets the Amazons apart, the Gladiators apart from all the other teams in this competition, is the fact of how well they work together. And you'll notice that although she definitely has the most touchdowns scored, there is a good distribution that a lot of the other players on the team have scored touchdowns. So that is a threat that any team will have to look out for. And one thing I want to point out is the last time we faced each other was, as you mentioned, uh, round two of the last season after I faced and lost against the Drakes. So could that be a prediction of the future? Or does do things repeat themselves? I, I guess we'll find out. That is true. Now, Thassa, in an earlier match this round, I mentioned the fact that the Fungus Bay Fanatics needed your team to lose or draw tonight in order to keep their team in playoffs contention. I actually made a mistake as the details of one match had not yet been added to the standings at the time. I can confirm here tonight that based on the results of this round so far, there are no longer any. there's no longer any path for Fanatics to make the playoffs. The most they can achieve is eight competition points, and there are currently eight teams on nine more points. Knowing this, and knowing that your currently uh, your team currently sits on the wrong side of the equation, do you have sympathy towards Fnatic's and their fan base? And how do you avoid a absolutely similar fate? Absolutely not. I absolutely have no 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 sympathy for the for the Fnatic's. Listen, I will tell you that the Fnatic's are a respectable team, but let's be honest. They're one. They're goblins, and goblins are always quite shifty. They have all kinds of silly tricks and pranks and things like that to pull. So you always have to keep your eyes open with goblins. But this team, the Fanatics, it's a wonder that they're doing as well as they are this season. And frankly, I am not surprised and totally expect to see them resume their lower positions by the end of the season. What about you, Bungo? Do you have anything to say about the effective elimination of the Fungus back the next from this season's competition? Oh, absolutely not. Everyone loves seeing Goblins get beat up. And, you know, that's just... You know, every fan loves to see that. So, yeah, it's, it's you know, predictable and not surprising at all that uh, they've been eliminated. But, you know, they have, people like their secret weapons and, you know, they, they love some of the shenanigans they get up to. But the only thing better than secret weapons for the fans is just seeing a goblin get driven into the ground. So better luck next season. But, you know, the fans got a good show at least. And of course, we have seen two goblins get eaten this season as well. I was considering that myself. <laughs> Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> All right, gentlemen, it is getting close to game time. So let me first ask you, Thassa, is there anything else that you would like to add? Go Marauders. What about you, Bungo? Any final thoughts before the match? Go Gladiators, and I hope I don't beat the Marauders too bad. Brilliant. Oh. Thank you both for your comments. Well, sports fans, these, teams, these two teams are always entertaining to watch. And any match where they play one another, it's doubly entertaining. I think tonight we're going to see a lot of skill, or lack thereof, and a lot of luck, or lack thereof. I really don't know how this match is going to go, except to say that it's going to be amazing to watch. It's time to sit down, crack, up, crack open your can of Bugman 7X, and together, we're going to watch some Blood Bowl. All right. Let's do some dice rolling. We're going to start with, uh, with you, Omar. Would you like to roll corporate to improve your chances of getting a sponsor, or maybe some more money? I will roll. I have no modifier. All right. 2d6. Uh, nope, that is no sponsor for you today. And it's okay. Get my shit rolls out of the way now. And what about you, Foe? Uh, yes, I will also like to make a uh, roll here. No modifier as well. Okay, well, that, that is that is a seven, which is a partial success, so you will get a plus two on the roll to find a sponsor if you want to at the okay. end of the match. Uh, okay, over to you, Omar. Would you prefer to roll promotion or the D3 for your fan factor? 
if I recall correctly, and I think I even said this exact same thing last match, but I believe the D3 gives me a statistical slight advantage. If you if you have a plus zero, then the D3 is better. Yeah, so I'll roll the three. I All got right. a two. All right, we'll put that in there. Uh, what about you, Foe? I'll roll the uh, 2d6, because I have a plus three on that. Okay. Oh, it's a big three for you. Oh, nice. Oh. Yep. Okay, and finally, Omar, a training roll? Do you want to try and get a pro? Plus one. 11. Yes, you may pick a player to get pro to. It cannot be Minzor or one of your um or, or your or your mercenary or either of your journeymen. Yeah. It's pretty much one of these four. Uh, let's see. Let's give it to Hmm. Hmm, that's actually a really good question. We'll give it to Full. Full, all right. Number five. And you can refresh him now. Right, we can refresh base info. And uh for you, Fo, trading roll? Yep, uh, plus three on this. That is enough. You keep rolling, who, who you you keep rolling that one every match, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's see here. Um, I'm going to give it to... Um, hmm. uh, Pro will let me re-roll Dauntless. It right? will, yes. Okay, I'll put it on uh, Samopoli then. Okay. All right, you can refresh her. All right. Fasir right. got one of them, uh, almost looks like a Japanese war banner hanging over her head. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> yeah. Almost like a, like, like a treatment, treatment, get that many skills. Uh, yeah. <laughs> all right, so we can both start the match in tour play. All right. Is there a promote? Oh, no, never mind, never mind. And then no. um, you, can, uh, put, you can put in two? your two for you and three for a uh, for foe into your... All right, let's roll a d6 each for the weather. So d6 from you, please, Omar. It's a three, d6 from you, Fo. Four, so that mm -hmm. is uh, no special weather, unless, <laughs> Fo, you wanted to shift it towards either pouring rain or lava bombs. <laughs> I am tempted to move it towards uh, lava bombs, but gosh, that with bonehead on every plate, it would be one thing if it was like you roll like a, you know, a D6 and like on a one, you have to pick like a random player. But I, I think with the, you know, limited uh, skill access we have, I think I'm just, I think Bungo would just let it, you know, just. <laughs> Bungo's like, nope, I'm not playing with the no, weather gods No, today. no, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, we're not tempting, we're not tempting fate here. All right, perfect conditions it is. Um, all, right. all right, so you need to do the journeyman. It'll tell you how many you need to do in tour play. I think it's two for each of you, though. Uh, yeah, two. Yeah, two for me. Okay, and then uh, you can ignore your, um, unless you're doing petty cash expenses. And then when it comes to you, Omar, you need to add in um, your mercenary. Arm start. You yeah. need to add in a coach and a desperate measure. Oh, I didn't add all of them. That's Shit. right. It won't matter. Um, so you can now roll a D8 for your desperate measure. See what you get. Six. Six. I mean, is that set piece? Um, no, six is sports espionage. Um, Ooh. so, uh, once during the game, when you suffer a turnover, i.e. because one of your players falls down or fails to catch a ball, etc., uh, you can get a free team re-roll. Oh. And okay. That's big for somebody that has no re-rolls. That's true. Although and we don't know how to use it. It's That's the problem. Four <laughs> loaner players, though, as well. Um, yeah. and, yeah. uh, do either of you have help comes at last? I do. Nope. Okay. Roll a D6 for help comes at last. Uh, yeah. Three plus for, a. Uh... Additional uh, 1d6. There we go. I almost rolled a two. Yes, so right. another d8. See what you get. Three is one of the less exciting ones. Uh, three is hungover. So one of uh, Foe's players will be unable to play in the first drive of the match because they got, got to the match late. So we're going to roll d8 starting from Fisera moving across oh. to Sophia. This Sorry. is where my luck starts to fall apart. Go ahead. Roll it. Well, you want a one. Yeah. Oh, I'm, yeah, the one on. I the one I want on the field is going to come off. Six, no, one, two, six. three, four, five, six. So Penelope is one of the journeyman. Uh, late to the match, uh, and then you have uh, my friend from medical school, I believe, Omar. Yes. So roll, uh, roll a d six. Three plus. Yes. So yeah. you have an apothecary for this match as well. Uh, do you have that one at all, Bo? No, I don't. Okay. 
I think that's all of our setup done. So I believe now it's just a case of Flo picking heads or tails, and then Omar flipping the coin. All right, tails uh, never fails. Button, right? Yep. Token. Yep. Token. Yeah. That is tails. So Flo, tail. would you like to kick or receive in the first half? Oh man. Um. Good question. I'm down a player already. Uh. Uh, what do I want to do? Um, I think I'll kick. I'll, I'll kick to him. Okay. So, Emma, you need to remove one player. Uh, maybe actually, yeah, just one player. And uh, yep. Foe, you can set up to kick off. Yep. Uh, where is my... Oh, this is the standby box. Yep. Reserve box, sorry. No hands. So that mean I, uh, the, the Merc can't grab he, a he ball? Can't pack, he can't pick up the ball. Nope. That's right. His hands are uh, full. Which I don't think that was his intent <laughs> yeah. anyway. His hands, no, his hands I just noticed that. Else. But I mean, it makes sense why he has no hands. So. Yeah. <laughs> I think one, one version of uh, previous Blood Bowl rules said if you, had a, if you had a chainsaw, there was a chance you could pop the ball by trying to pick it up. That actually would be hilarious. That's funny. <laughs> I don't know. What, the, what would be the penalty for that, though? Uh, it's a new ball that gets thrown in. That's all. Oh, so it's just yeah, for yeah. story effect. Yeah, but it's a, it's a turnover and it just gets thrown somewhere random on the pitch. So that actually makes more sense. Yeah. Okay, I am right. set up. All right, you can set up to receive then, Emma. So just make a note, foe, that um, Ball has the serving presence. So any attempts to. Yep. Pick up, throw, or catch the ball near him or at minus one. Yep. Even if he's even if he's prone, it still goes off. No, we'll go ahead and put it. Is it there. to pick up the ball too? I thought it was just to throw the ball. Uh, uh throw it's interferes with pass and I believe intercepting. Did, I, I, I might be misremembering it. It does definitely have a, a three square range. Um, yeah, pretty sure it's three. Let me look it up. All right, let's look at the book out. Because uh, I remember, uh, I forgot the star player that uh, I had last season. Uh, the Amazon, she had that too. Yeah. Um, disturbing presence. Uh, every time an opposition player performs either the pass action, the throw teammate action, or the throw bomb special action, or attempts to interfere with the pass or catch the ball. So it's not picking yep. up, but it's it's throwing. It's not right. picking up, but it's everything else. Yeah, throwing or catching. <laughs> yeah. Yep. All right. So. Uh, yeah, I'm set up. Sorry. Where are you kicking the ball to, Fo? Oh, that is a strong line there. <laughs> uh, let's see. I think I will just kick it right behind the mercenary. Oops. Uh, right there. All right. Roll a debate roll. All right. Three to one, one, two, three, and then two D six for the kickoff event. Three is a timeout. So both <laughs> blocks move forward one. Yep. And then D eight see where the ball bounces. To six, so it goes back to there. All right, Omar, could you into a play start turn, end turn, start turn? That will get <laughs> you on to uh to uh turn two. Oh, yes, because we have to. All right, Paul, I need you to hit. Oh, no, you can hit start. Oh, you need to end... oh no. Okay. Yeah, okay, I cool. see what you're saying. Yeah. All right. I thought I had to wait for him to do his bit. No, no. That's okay. So you're up, Omar? All right. Yeah, I am. That's uh, interesting. Uh... Let's see. One, two. Yeah. Once again, I have to make remarks about great grid pattern. Makes it hard to count squares though. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, two. Yeah, 
he should be fine. Uh, Hef is going to pick up the ball. Uh, the, 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 the arms is for catching, I believe. Yeah, I think it does also affect picking up. Um, I think yeah, it's, can... a, it's a plus one on. Yeah, so you yeah, pick so up about two plus. Two plus. Yeah. yeah. Okay, he's got the ball. Yeah. Wait a minute. Uh, and then okay. I'm gonna put. I need a four plus to activate the. If you're not, if you if, you, if, you, if it's just the move, yeah. Although if you're not blitzing, yeah. you can blitz the move. Um, I need to go for it to hit though. One, two, three, four, five. Go for it to get to range, and then uh, go for it to hit. Yeah. Or you, mm. or you could blitz with. Or the, I could blitz with the other guy. Yeah, because he's got seven movement. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna. Well, leave he's got frenzy, he... so you basically only get like one block there. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you got to go for it twice just to do it, and you only get the one hit then because you can't follow up after that. Mm. Yeah, I'll put him here, and then four plus to move Minzer. Yep, you can move. And then put him here. <laughs> Come at me, bro. Okay. <laughs> All right. So you, cage. you can start turn two in uh, two of play. All right. Start turn. Um, hmm. okay. I believe the, the standards were I don't have to beat you. I just have to keep you from winning. <laughs> At least that was what was requested of the dark elder, dark wise elders. Well, that's what I mean, Lord Hunger. Yeah, I was gonna say, are you, are you taking advice from Lord Hunger? Because yeah, <laughs> Lord, the, the only advice Lord Hunger gives is what's good for Lord Hunger. Oh no, I'm well aware. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? It happens to align with some of the destruction and chaos that I want to cause. <laughs> yeah. Um. Hmm. Let's do. I just realized the last time we played was also your longest Two, Blood Bowl match three, video, three, James. Four, five. At just under three hours. Well, not, not like I've got anything important like a flight to get to later on, you know. But, uh... <laughs> well, I was just, I was making that reference, one for the fact, and then two just for like, I wonder if we're going to break that record. Because <laughs> if I remember right, it's like just under three hours. But you know, we both were long-winded. I didn't know what the hell I was doing. Bohammer tends to take a few, a little bit longer than most because he's thinking his, his moves step. through. Which I'm not knocking it. You know, some people are that way. I Me, mean, I'm just like this round. I want to do this. It may or may not have anything to do with anything that happened in the previous rounds. Okay, I'm gonna declare a uh, blitz Bring with um, Samopoli onto the Minotaur. Yep. Um, so do I roll Dauntless first? No, no you, I, you, you, um, get, you get there first. Do the movement, and then yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll get to there. Yeah, go for it. So you do the go um, for so it first. So now you need to do the go for it first. Yep. Oh, yeah. You, yeah, yeah. You're fine? Okay, now you do the okay, Dauntless on a three plus. roll Dauntless. Yep. Three plus. Yep. So now it'll be two dice for the block. All right. Got him. He has to All go right, there. And it goes. Yep, has to go there. Um, I will not follow up. Okay, I'm a roll. Good All luck. Right. <laughs> All right, let me stop with my smug cock. Uh, that's here. not true, no. Nope. Yeah, he's a nine, right? Yeah. Yes. He's nine or ten. Okay. Nine. No, no, my, it's my blockers that are ten. Um... I should have did that the wrong way. I should have used hit point. Um, you know what? Hell with it. We'll we'll do a follow. I gotta do a uh, go for it to get there with uh, Sophia. You're follow, so follow the the troll. So or, one, not the troll. Two, Mentor. three, four, five, six, go seven. For go for it. Plus. Oh jeez. <laughs> you want to use a reroll or uh, on a, she's on a, a five loner, though. Five, yeah. uh, so I'm just gonna let it be. Yeah. Okay. Goes. Roll armor, please. Emma. Oh yeah. Sorry. Not through. Okay, that's a turnover. I guess I could have used the uh, uh, manager reroll, but I think it's better to stay. That's just the first turn. Right. Well, technically the second turn. So start uh, <laughs> you start your turn three into a play, Omar. Yes. All right. Let me see. What do we got? What are we looking at here? Three, six, 
So that's one, one, two, three, four, five, six. And if I counted my squares right, I can do that without having to dodge because one yeah. move laterally, yep. diagonal. You can, so, yes. Uh, and then I'm going to blitz with arm Stark. Uh, do I when I hit with arm Stark with that secret weapon, is that separate than a blitz? How does it, that work? It's 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 still part of a blitz, so you still need to use a blitz to do the action. Okay, all right, because that's what I'm going to do on yeah. Fasira. I'm just yeah. double checking that I can clear tackle zones and not dodge and shit. So one, two, three, four, five. Oh yeah, perfect. Yeah that All right. and then i believe that's two so, dice well, it's a d6 first for the kickback because on a one oh, yes. on a one he hits himself yep yep okay so it's fine so it's two dice plus three uh yeah uh 2d6 plus three correct? that's right yep yep okay yep. okay that knocks her down Ten. all right yep. and then you make an injury roll so she is yes. ko'd Ah, do you want to use? Do you want to carry that one, Bo, to keep her on the pitch? Do you have um, a Did I miss? Do that I one? have to roll it to keep? No, her on no. The, if, if, uh, the pitch. I think it is. A, yes, it's still a four plus to keep her on the pitch, and that's your apothecary use then. Uh, hmm. It could be big though. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I will try to uh, keep her on the. Even though it's just a KO, I'll try to okay, keep her so. on. Roll the so, uh, D6. Yep. Got her. Oh, okay, so she's just stunned instead. Yep. All right, you can keep going there, uh, Omar. Yep. Uh, let's see, what else do we got here that I want to do? I'm going to bring... I'm going to foul with... All right, I'm going to put full up here. Okay. And then I may foul if I have enough points to make it worthwhile but i feel like unless i stand up the minotaur i'm not going to have any assists no in fact you've got two counter assists right now because it, it works so, like a block so there fouling wouldn't be the best move it would make. so if foul was the doing his own right now it would be a 10 plus okay uh full hammer i'm gonna shift uh what's his face over one square are you okay with that yeah, that's yeah, fine. yeah no other players actually made sense then yeah yeah okay um and then let's see i need to bring my ball carrier somewhere else okay all right four plus to stand up the minotaur yep no, nope. he stays down. Stays staring at the sky. Okay. In that case. Um, I think bring him up. Bring him up. Bring him over one. So now if you have to hit me, you've got some dodging or some a lot of movement points to use. I think that's everybody. Yep. That will end my turn. Okay. Begin turn three, four. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Um, Would you roll uh, Fasira over right now, or is that waiting? Uh, no, at the, end of, at the end of his turn. So oh, okay. any, end, any, that's right. yeah, any turn in which a player starts the turn stun, they roll over at the end. Gotcha. I, I just wasn't sure about the timing on that. Because I know they wouldn't be available this round. Yeah. Okay. Um... Um, 
All right, I am going to uh, stand up, Sophia. Yep. Um, and just to aggravate uh, Omar here, I'm going to be uh, cheeky, and I'll declare a blitz with Samopoli onto half the ball carrier. Yep. So first thing is dodge out. Three plus. Three plus with a reroll. If you're good. Got it. So that's one, two, three. Um, I'll go to there for. Out for five, so another dodge. Three plus. Yep. Got it. Six. Six to there with a go for it for the blitz. Good. Uh, whoa. Oh, it was, oh, it was, it really was thinking idea. about it. One this dice. will just be a one dot. It will be one dice. Skull. Yeah. Um, and Damn, you got that block. Though. I am going to use one of my rerolls. Okay. Oh, no, you don't have block. That's to reroll. Is that, that block or fend? Uh, no, it's, it's that, block. It's block here, yeah, but okay. Yeah. All right, reroll. Both down, Gotta but he. Down. Okay, so roll armor first. Yep. Uh, armor. Uh, that is through injury. Yep. Shit. Injury is stun, and then stun. D8 see where the ball goes. Goes to three, so it goes. It bounces on Minter <laughs> then. Yep. So another deviate. Yep. Or D8, I should say. To five, so it goes five. to Pack, who will catch it on a three, four, five, it's six. Be a six. Yeah. <laughs> so Omar, oh this is you. God. Six. Jesus. No, D eight. Omar, let's see where it goes. Eight. So it goes bounces on uh, Hef again. <laughs> D eight. Omar. <laughs> to eight. So it comes out there. Okay. Oh hell. Then you don't get out because um, you get that stupid block that I always want to get. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's see. I'll do a block with uh, Snopathy onto uh, Zog. Nice. That'll be another one die. Yep. Push. Push. Um, not what I wanted. <laughs> no, because it doesn't help you get to the ball any better. <laughs> yeah. Um, I'll push him there. Hold on. Uh, and no, you can't. Uh, you can. Can you push him there? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my bad. Yeah, those my bad. I was thinking. I was thinking that only the two. Yep. <laughs> Follow up. Um. And. I guess it doesn't matter because they're all going to be canceled out by the. Uh... I'll just do a. Um... Well, before I do that, to... do I want to do that. Uh... No, I think I'll just leave Kriantha there. I'll do a foul with Hippolyte onto the Minotaur again. Okay. So one, two, three. Uh... Four to there. No, it's just either way, um, so it's just got to be on a nine yeah. plus. Oh, yeah. eight, eight plus if you use your uh, yeah. 35. If I do the uh, yeah, the did you get sneaky get or dirty player? No, dirty player. Dirt, okay, so that won't be enough even with so that, dirty player. Yep, not but either. you still record still record the foul into a play. Yep. Did you record uh, the other? Oh no, you didn't get the foul because uh, you slipped no. and fell. No, you? because I slipped on the go for it. Yeah, yeah. that's right. <laughs> yeah, the intent was there, um, but the action was not. Yeah, yeah, the effort was certainly there. Yeah. Um, Record it into a play. Yeah, I was just gonna uh, before I do that, I'll do. Uh, I'm gonna go one, two to there. I know it's a dangerous thing to do, but I just want to mark that uh, mercenary so he doesn't mess things up here. Okay, so uh, foul with or, uh, Hippolyte, and then Basira yeah. turns over, yeah. and Omar, you can start turn four into a play. Yeah. Uh, with uh, all right, let's see, blitzing. Uh, synth oh my god, I hate your character's names. Uh, this one, <laughs> we're blitzing that one with the bowl. Okay, so on a two plus, two plus, yes, so he's right. up. So and it's gonna be uh, two dice. Yeah, got her. Where do you want to drop her? There, right there. Have to follow up because you've got follow up. Frenzy armor roll. Uh, 
uh, Mighty Blow. Well, we took all armor with us. That's on the injury if you get through the armor without needing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so you got through without and needing you... it, so you can do in plus one injury using the Mighty Blow there. So this is a stun <laughs> regardless. <laughs> all right, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Okay, and then I'm going to have the Merc Foul for Sarah, for Sarah, whatever. Okay, so it'll be plus one, plus minus one, so it'll be plus, just 2d6 plus three. 2d6 plus three. Yep. Okay, that is through. That is 13. So injury. Oh, so you got a kickback as well, so. Okay, so she's oh, going yeah. to be stunned, yeah, but yeah. Roll, roll a d6. Okay, that's fine. So yep. she's stunned again, and record a foul for Armstark. There were no doubles in there, so no send-off. Correct. And then I'm going to mark her, because I can play that game too. And then I'm going to block Sophia with with four. One dice. One? Yeah, because it's oh, three. Cause three, cause three, three. Yep. Yep. Uh, he's got pro. He's got pro, so you can roll a d6 to use pro. Oh, yeah, pro. Yeah, pro. Uh, 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 three, what the... three, three plus on a d6. No, so he goes down. Uh, so but... Armor roll? Pro? Yep. We'll get to that in a second. Yeah. Uh, not through. So now, if you want to, you can claim your free reroll now, Omar. Yep. Uh, so I can claim it, but I can't use it. Is that right? No, that's what he turns over regardless. Okay. Shit. Is the reroll just for the drive or is it's, it for it's, it's, it's for the drive. Well, it's for the half. So it's half, you, okay. Yeah, do you want to take the reroll now? You've got two turns left to use it. Yeah. Uh yeah, I'll take it. Okay. Or if you have another uh turnover later, you know, then you can claim Well, the, yeah, well, I'm I'm going to take it now just to cuz I feel like yep. if I don't take it now, I'm not going to get it. Okay. All right. So, Start so, turn. Yep. That sounded yep. a little weird. Realistically, go ahead and grab the ball and run it in, you son of a gun. <laughs> not without some uh, go for it. Oh. Or wait, not with at least one go for it. No, she, you got it. it. One, yeah. two, There's three, nothing four, stopping five, you. Six. Yeah, the only thing I gotta do is just pick up the ball. So, yeah, yeah. one, two, so, yeah, pick, pick up the ball, ball. three plus. Yep, it's hanging in the air. Yep, go on. Yeah. That's it. Got the ball. Got it. All right. And I'll just run it in touchdown for Simopoli. Okay. If you ever wonder why I hate you, Full Hammer, this is it right here. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not you, me, I mean, it's the Amazon. You could have Zog, <laughs> Zog could have gone for the ball in your turn, I miles. So that's why like No, I know. Yeah. Well, I, I didn't see that right away. Yeah. I was focused on the other side and I needed to get one of those goats to get away yeah. from the line. That's why I went for the block. Yeah, but Zog was free. I probably blocked with the wrong one, but yeah, I didn't yeah. see that. Yeah. Like a dumbass. So record the score there. Yeah, I'll put it here. Yep, I will reset all players. So now uh, we need to roll. So first off, um, Yarp is getting sent off. Unless you want to argue the call, over on a d six. Uh, yeah. How's that six to... Yep. I need a six to keep him. Yep. Yep. Six to keep him. Yep. And what happens if I don't keep him? Other than him leaving, he's off for the rest of the match. If you roll a one, though, you're off for the rest of the match as well. So you can't argue. Well, you can't. Calls. You can't argue future calls. I feel like that's a fair trade. Oh, okay, so off goes Yar. <laughs> All right, off, off goes Tharsa as well to the also to the yep. Simbin. And yep. uh, that comes your other Where journeyman. Other dude. Uh, so record a send off for Yarp in uh, to a play, please. Yeah. Well, he was most likely going to go anyway. Um, we anticipated that. And then Fo, you're sitting up to kick off. Yep. All right, I'm set up. Oh, I thought am I set up to re receive? All right, where's the ball going, Bo? No surprise, just gonna go right behind the minotaur. Okay. Spot for it. Deviate yeah. roll. All right. 
Uh, four to eight is going to be, oops, one, two, three, four, and then two to six for the kickoff event. That's 11 actually. is officious ref. So, uh, Omar roll D6, add five. Seven. Seven. Okay. Uh, Bo roll D6, add eight. eight. It's going to be me. I keep. He's there we go. Yep. No okay. So it's going to be uh, Fo roll me a D eight. We'll go left to right, starting with Rem. All right. The balls. Three. Are so it's guys. pack, uh, and then Omar roll D six to see what happens. Oh my god. Oh, he is sent <laughs> off for the rest of the match. So I am so sorry. Uh, so Omar I'll just record a send this off is... for one of the journeymen. This is exactly what happened the last time we played where all the dice decided to suddenly take a shit on me uh that was wasn't it like back-to-back -back blitzes or something yeah. like that yeah. it was it was yeah. and then uh foe dead see where the ball bounces all right the six which is back into the end zone end zone yep. all right and omar you can start your turn five now so i think that you can't score this half now because no, you can't get the ball i'm not even gonna try move yeah, that far uh, who's that? Yep. Um, all right. I've done this before. I'm going to blitz with the Minotaur onto Fasira. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. So mm -hmm. I need a go for it just well, to first get off, you, there. You need two plus first off for the animal savagery. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay, fine. Now you need to go for it to get to I, that I space. got so, I got so like ready to just rip Foe Hammer's team in, into pieces. All right. Now you need another go for it to actually hit. You're good. And then right. two dice for the hit. Uh, it's a, either both down or, well, no, it's either you're down or, or nothing. She just, she just dodged, dodged back. So he has to go there yep, and so you have to push. go there. Yep. Yeah. I'm yep. definitely not taking double down. Uh, all right. Now we need to shore up the Minotaur who is torn off down the field to cause problems. So, uh, if I'm not mistaken, this is six straight down. Yeah. It's all six across the end, across the, um, yeah. Uh, he should be able to one, two, three, four. You want to make sure you leave because like, he's going to send a play because he, he could score by sending a player down the sideline to get pick up that ball in the end zone. Still, he's got two turns to do that. So I would just take one of your players or maybe two players and like you know put them on the ball just to make it that much harder, even if you don't try to pick it up. Yeah, because yeah, he's absolutely right. I, I could still score. And you're kicking off uh, to me in the second half. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three. All right, it's everybody. Yep. All right. All right. Turn five, foe. <laughs> yep. Turn five. Not Turn only five. is Thassa pissed right now because he has to watch this from even more of a distance he's probably like throwing chairs cursing the officious refs all right one two three four five six um um do i want to move her um one two three to there one two three four five six um any of those three would be one dice onto the Minutes. Oh, no, two dice because you got the support from Sophia. Yeah, two dice because that's why I moved. <laughs> yeah. Why I moved her there. Yeah. Um. So let's see. I guess it's just a question of where I want to. Um. We'll do a uh, block with Creantha onto the Minotaur. Okay. So, so two that dice. Be two dice. Three, four, five, six. Yeah. Yep. Oh geez, <laughs> um, and she the the one that does not have. Um, do I want to re-roll that? No. You um. 
Yeah, I only got two turns left. I'll uh, use my right. last reroll of the half to reroll that. Watch it come off double skulls. Ah! <laughs> okay. yeah, I can't use my ability because I rerolled it all. Yep. All right. Uh, so, uh, and you got an injury roll now. Okay. Am I make a make an armor roll? Ah, <laughs> uh, that's not through. No. Okay. All right, Omar, I'm you can sorry. start turn six. I was gonna say I, I still have that reroll that I need yeah. to use, don't I? This is your turn to use it because it will yep. go away at the end of this turn. Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, what do I want to do here? I'm going to. All right. First things first. I'm going to block Smopoli. Yep. This one. Yep. With. Zod. No, I'll do. I'll use. Hold on. Let me re let me think for a second here. I'm gonna hit her with one of these two. I'm struggling yeah. out which one I want. Oh, uh, I guess it really doesn't matter that much. Well, the, the, the advantage if you hit with Bowl is you can you can potentially knock her to there and follow up and then still get two dice with Zog. Yeah. Yep. Uh, so that's two dice here. Uh, yep. it, it will be with Bowl, by the way. Sorry. Yep. Okay, so you may as well use because you may as well use his pro now. So roll roll the three plus for his pro. No, that doesn't work, Oops. so it's just going to be a push. So if you push it to there, it'll follow up. Yep, follow think... up. <laughs> and now Zog can do a two dice hit. Yep. On her. Got her. Got her. I'll just send her back that way. And I am... Well, yeah, we'll have to follow I'm up. Roll. That's not through. Nope. Okay. All right. Now... Um, just trying to think which order I want to do this in. Uh, Minotaur blocking. Would be one Syrah. one dice right now because yeah, he's got two you assists. Want... You would need to you would need to yeah. have Pep mark one of those two to bring it up but, the two yeah, dice. Mark, mark will do that. Okay. Um, but just uh, one thing I want to point out well i guess it depends on what you want to do you you do your own thing yeah because i mean yeah, he, yeah. He, has, he has got 70 that could run and... that, that's exactly what i was gonna say i could still score with him if oh yeah, yeah i've yeah you've got somebody that's in the scoring position i yeah. can do something with i mean you, you haven't blitzed so you could potentially blitz with minzo to get the extra strength to still hit twice yeah but um, i'm gonna use i'm was gonna use that blitz to hit uh somebody yeah Somebody else. <laughs> I'll just say that. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna mark. Uh, I guess yeah, we'll go here. Yep. And then that puts us on two dice on Fasira, yep. whatever her name is. Yep. And we'll savagery first. Ah, god damn it! I keep forgetting that. Okay, so the first one's a push. So where do you want to push her to? Uh, we'll just push her. Who does it matter? I don't think it matters because I'm going to that same square regardless. And then two dice on the follow up block. Yeah. How? Just push, push again because she's got dodge. And I have to follow up again. Yep. All right. Now. Uh, do I believe it's a one die block onto Penelope? Yes. Push. Push. And Are you following and, up? Yeah, we need to keep her marked. And then lastly, should be a two die block on With a blitz. A blitz. Yeah, that's yeah. what I meant. Yeah. 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 Uh, so one, two, three, four, five. Yep. Two dice. Just a push. God damn it. Push. Did, did you want to use your reroll on that one to try and get a better result? Yes. Yes. All right. Yeah, so. this be your last that's my, yeah, that's, yeah, it's my last move for the round. So yeah. uh, it's both, just a straight roll up reroll. Right? Yeah, that's right. Yep, got her. There we go. Got her. So what yep. do you want? Can't score now. All right, armor roll. Not through. God All damn right. it. All, All right. right, that is my turn. And then foe, start turn six. All right. I really wanted the knockdowns, but the push is helpful on those yep. two, especially. Stand up, Krantha. Um, I 
really matter. Um, I'll do a uh, blitz with Simopoli onto the Minotaur. Yep. So for you to stand uh, up. actually, can I even do that? That'll be three, four, five. It'll be go for it. For the blitz. Stand up. Yeah, it would be one go for it for the blitz. So stand up for three. Yep. Dodge out. Three plus. Three plus. Good. Yep. All right. Four, five, six. Go for it. Go for it for the blitz. Nope. That's it. Right. She's, no got, she's got she got pro. Oh, that's right. She does have pro. So yep. uh three plus. Three plus. Yep. And then re-roll yep. the re-roll the no. go for it. Fine. Okay. And no. then yeah, now Man, three, three, so plus, wait for the... three plus Dauntless. <laughs> yep. I was waiting for a one there. Okay, so it'll be two dice on the block. Yep. Got him. Oof. Got him. So we'll just move him back this way. Yep. Follow up. Armor roll. Um, not through. Nope, not through. Um, but now I'll do a foul with uh, Hippolyte yep. into the Minotaur. Plus two. So I, maybe plus yep, three. Plus two. Uh, so seven, eight, uh, nine. That is through, through without so, the... so now you can do plus one of the injury. What's the plus one from injury come from? Uh, because he's he's got uh, she's dirty, got dirty player, player, which is like it's like ah. mighty blow for fouling. So it's just a stun regardless. Gotcha. It's just stun. Yeah. All right, Al, in my turn. Okay. Can't do nothing else. So. Oh, I'm gonna. No, I was gonna make a joke, or I was gonna say something controversial, but it would it was strictly as a joke. <laughs> Somebody would have misunderstood it. <laughs> something about coming to Chicago to see you. <laughs> that way. All right. So. We we'll um, drink plenty of beer. Yeah. Okay, so end your turn on tour play this so we can do the half time stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, you know, I've been forgetting. I've been forgetting. Once again, the um, the uh, crowd music or the crowd sound. Come on. For some reason, Omar's not loading it. I don't know why. Anyway, let me go. While they're waiting for this, let's go back to the. Uh, the oh, it disconnected. Omar, I want to try to load the crowd sound. Yeah, Omar disconnected. <laughs> it disconnected, and then the crowd just started. <laughs> <laughs> Omar is going to hate that. <laughs> oh, is Omar frozen on Zoom or something? Yeah, he might have lost uh, connection. It looks like right. I. I don't know oh, what happened is. on my end. But I'm assuming when you started playing the music that I got dropped from yeah. everything. So I'm gonna. I'm reloading TTS now. Okay. Like, I I don't know what happened to be honest. All right. Well, while we're waiting for you to load, let me do the uh, the half time uh, with uh, with Fo as uh, as Wilhelm <laughs> comes into the uh, the chaos change room. Bungo, that uh, I I didn't like the way things were looking for you at the very start there, but it quickly turned around. Yes, it definitely uh, was sketchy at the beginning there, Wilhelm, but. Uh... You know, I will say this, that, uh, you know, this is definitely a team that can cause a lot of injuries and the, you know, the gladiators, the, you know, the, we just don't play with a lot of armor. So there could definitely be uh, some more injuries here and that could very well turn this around. It could still turn into a, a victory for the Marauders. So we just got to play carefully here, you know, be uh, careful about, you know, our uh, blocks that we make and just see if maybe we can get another uh, score to, you know, protect our lead here. Well, the refs, de the refs definitely seem to be uh, on on the side of your team. Yeah, that's that, that's unusual. That, you know, us being an away team here. You know, they they definitely normally that happens when we're at home. But uh, yeah, you know, we'll see if uh, the refs continue to show bias towards us or not in the second half. All right, uh, and I think that Wilhelm walks into the um, the uh, gladiator, so the Marauders change room and can't find Tharsa because Tharsa is in the penalty bin. So, yeah, uh, and that penalty <laughs> bin is destroyed with debris of all sorts of broken tables and shit. Well, you've got to, you've got to, uh, a guy with a chainsaw and a, and a, 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 a beastman that help you now. So oh, that, now it's become a constructive deconstruction. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it's more therapeutic than anything else at this point. Right. <laughs> he's probably getting he's getting tips from the merc on what parts to actually break to get more destruction out of it. That's it. Yeah, it's demo day. <laughs> it's definitely one of those angry rooms. <laughs> uh, all right, have you seen Insight Two, Fo? This uh, came out this week. 
I'm sorry, say that again. Have you seen Inside Out 2? Yeah, 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 I went to see it yeah. with my, uh, yeah, the, I thought, the yeah, it's demo day, yes. that's it, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Are you, so, are you still need to record Hippolyte's Foul, sorry, until I just realized that wasn't recorded. I thought I did record Hippolyte. Oh, the, the last turn one, yeah. yeah that's it. Yep. Let so, me, uh, go back and do that. Do I have to go back and click on No, the, no, that's the fine. Just, just, just put it in now, because it, it'll, it'll add it to the player stat. That's the important thing. Okay. All right. Uh, and so, so, Omar, you're now setting up to kick off in the second half. Yeah, I am. I really need the ball on my side of the board. Um, right, let me see. Um, yeah, why not? Okay. All right, I'm set. All right. Go for it, Fo. Yep. No uh, on the ball player this time. Right. Oh. I'm just swapping players is all. So. Oh, good. I had two just desperate measures. Alarms. Yes. What was my second one? Uh, the so you had the um one of the these one players where I missed turn, the... turns up late. Oh yes, yeah, yes, and yes, the, yes. And the um what's espionage with the extra reroll. That's right. That's yep. right. Okay. All right. Where are you kicking the ball to? My house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna drop it right here. All right. Roll uh, roll DB8. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Uh, five to three. One, two, three, four, five. And then 2d6 for the kickoff event. Six is uh, cheering fans. So d6 plus zero for you, Omar. It's five. D6 plus one for you, foe. Yep. Uh, it's both fives. On a five, neither person gets it. So no effect. Yep. And then d8, see where the ball bounces, Omar. To seven, so it bounces on to Fysera, who'll catch it on a four. Yep. No, so D8, foes, here it goes. Seven is directly in front it's of right her. right in front of her. All right, yep. and you can start your turn seven into a play, foe. All right. Okay, um... I guess uh, first thing is do I want to try it? No. All right, probably a mistake, but um, let's go one, two, three, four, five, six. Oops, I'm just the mouse is lagging here. I'm just trying to move up. Sure. Yep. There we go. Um, and I guess just move Hippolyte up. Yep. Uh, actually, I'll move Hippolyte here. Um, Uh, next is, um, I'll try to pick up the ball with my yep, zero. Three so plus. One. Got good. it. Got it. Okay, that's one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'll just go seven there. Uh... One, two, three, four. Actually, I think, uh, 
Yeah, you know what? I'll just move up here. Um, one, two, three, four to there, and then one, two, three, four. Just go there. Okay, last thing, uh, Blitz with Smopoli onto the Minotaur. Yep. So, one, two, three, four, five. Oop, ah. <laughs> Sorry, my mouse is lagging again. Uh, basically, six, just six right in front of them. Yep. There we go. Go for and it, then, Blitz. Yep, go for it. Ah, uh, of course. You want to use a pro uh, or Do I want to use pro or reroll? Um, I'll try for pro. Okay. Three plus. So three plus. Nope. Yeah, she get. Yep. All right. I'm a roll there, uh, Omar. Ah, uh, that's three. Eight. Injury. Yep. Uh, is a stunned. Stunned. Yep. Barely a stunned, but a stunned. <laughs> okay. And that then... actually <sighs> a little bit too. All right. You can start uh, your start turn, turn seven. Yep. All right, let's get started in here. Yeah, I almost said it too. Uh, what am I looking at here? So three, four, five. So that's two die block. Two dice from any Zog. any of those. Yeah, Zog. Oh, do I want Zog to do it or do I want? Depends whether you want to try and get more follow up blocks. If it doesn't go, she doesn't go down because Hef, yeah. Hef or Fall could knock her somewhere. You could still get a two dice block, but yeah. Zog will knock her straight back. Yeah, we'll do half, two dice. Yep. Okay, to push. So if you push her to... Do you want to follow up or stay where you are on the line? Follow up. I think yeah. that's going to give me... No, because my Minotaur is still marked by the other one. Yeah. But I still... So that's still a two die, two die block on yes. Zog now. Yes. That's a push. So they push, push. Her to one of these two. Uh, hit me. There we go. Do you want to follow up? No. Uh, because now I'm just going to be a two die block from Ruck onto Centipede. Yep. Centipede. Nice. Yep. <laughs> That's a push. So she has to get pushed to there. Um... See how frustrating it is without skills. You're basically a one in six chance of knocking them down. Yeah, it's okay. I'm working my way through this. Do I want to follow up? Though? No, I don't want to follow up because I need my Minotaur to be able to move. All right. Block, or excuse me, Blitzing Penelope with Minzer. Yep. So uh, two plus two, to Animal Savagery? Two, yeah, two plus to activate. And then... Un Unchamp Fury? Oh, uh, motherfucker. No. So he's going to be... No reroll. Yep. Yeah, no reroll. Yeah. So he's he's angry screaming right now. So and that <laughs> I ate love my that blitz. Little, uh, visual effect. Yeah, yep. he's eating the blitz though. Uh but I could still move Rem up. Yep. And I've got full that can move. Where do I want to put full? I need to put full somewhere that can hmm. where can I put full? It'd be useful. So you, so you got to remember that that, that Phystera can hit and run. So if Phystera runs out the side and locks Rug, she'll get a free move somewhere. So you can make you can put him somewhere that that because she can't move into a tackle zone. So if you put you know you put him put her something like put something like here, that mm -hmm. would limit the free move. That, that limits a lot of movement options. Yeah. Of course, the other problem too is squirting out the other side, but. All right. I probably shouldn't have said that out loud. That probably just screwed me, but whatever. All right, that'll do it. All right. So, start your turn eight. Yep. I have punched your cage around your ball. I tightened <laughs> your cage for you. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um... I'm pretty sure Unchannel Fury is one where he has no tackle zone because the base goes yeah. gray. That sounds right. Um, Actually, I think I think he does still have a tackle zone fight. I mean, I think it's yeah, bonehead. He doesn't have. A, yeah, double check. Um, yep. I'm looking. 
I gotta open up the page again though. Oh no, okay, no, it doesn't doesn't, doesn't actually doesn't um make the tackle zone. That's right, it's animal savagery. If you fail animal savagery and they become boneheaded. And I have unchanneled fury or whatever the That's hell right, it is. That's right, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So unchan unchanneled fury, they still kick tackle zone. Okay. One, two. Three. Uh, do I want to go three? Actually, I'll go four, five, six to there. Yep. Um, I'll do a block with, um, let me do this. Yeah, I'll do a two die block with uh, Synepathy onto uh, Rem. Rem. Yep, two dice. Yep. Push either one of these Just two. Push, all right. So I'll push him back here. Yep. Uh, follow up. Um, I'm going to move Sophia. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six to there. Yep. Um, I guess just for the heck of it, um, I will move uh, Penelope uh, one, two, three, four to there. Um, and Last thing is, I'll declare Blitz with Fysera onto Bull. Yep. So I'm going to go this way. One, two, three to there. Three plus dodge. Four, dodge out. Yep. Three plus. With a reroll? Uh, with a reroll. Yep. <laughs> I made it. <laughs> All right. So that was. Um, I think that was four. four. That was I four. might be wrong. That was four to there. One. Two, three, four to there. Yep. yep. Five yep. to there. Uh, six so for the, the blitz. Will be two dice. Uh, two dice. Don't you have? Am I crazy thinking that you have to dodge no. out to make the blitz? No. Am I crazy? No. It, it doesn't, have, doesn't have to. Okay. Yep. Okay. So Sorry, um, I didn't... I'll. Yeah. No worries. I'll take the. Uh, um, both both down. Block. No, they're both down. Okay. So he roll, goes down. Roll armor. Block it. Roll armor. That's through. It's through. God damn it. Injury. Oops. I just yeah. got a error message. Hang on. Did it roll injury? Oh, yeah. No. no. Okay. Yeah, I just got it. It was still rolling. So he's stunned. Okay. So it's six so far. Um, so it's six. Um, you can, you can hit, run, hit, hit and run, run there. Yep. Move there. And. Seven to there. Do I want to go for it? I guess no matter where I go, no matter where I go, they can get to her. Um, and go for it. You don't. There's not enough go for us to get into the end. Zone. No, he's only got two. He hasn't got no, no. Yeah, I do have uh, short feet, short feet but, not though, but yeah, th but yeah, but yeah, That's I'm not going to. Oh, that give you what is short? That's just re re roll. Go for re roll it. the, the uh, foul go for it. Yeah. All right, that'll be the end of my turn. Okay. Flow hammer, you son of a bitch. Sorry. <laughs> I mean, that's quite. That's I mean, quite... basically, you can still. Yeah. You, I mean, I you mean, did everything you were supposed to do on that round. So, if Stop. you can knock down synopathy. Yeah, you can get Minzer away to Blitz. If you, yeah, yeah, and you'll get like two blocks. Well, depending on what the dice results are. Yeah. Um, um, so, start your turn eight into a play. Oh, shit. Yeah. So, yeah. Rem, two dice. Rem will be like. two dice, yep. But she does have black. Actually, no. Uh, it will be. 
Oh, you can push it back. back. Push it back. Why? Because he's got assist from Rinza. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. we did establish yeah. it. It doesn't. Yeah. Uh, oh, uh, his uh, attack is on. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's fine. That's what we need because now Minza is free. Yep. yep. Now Minza is free. And then two. So oh, four. real quick. Were you going to follow up or no? No. 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 Okay. Uh, let's see. Well, hold on. Let me think for a second. One, two. Think one, two, three, four. I can get to here and blitz yep. that way. Yep. And then I don't have to worry about what you call it. And then but, so but that would plus. that that would be a, if you did that though. So if you went one, two, three, four, five for the blitz, you would need to roll a, 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 a go for it for the second. Go for it for the second. Okay. Yeah. All right, I can live with that. Okay. Two plus. Yep. Is good. So now come down here. Okay. So two dice for the first uh, block. Two dice. Got her. Got her. So we're gonna put it one of these two. Oh, we'll knock it back that way. You have to follow. Yep. Armor roll. That is through. Plus through. one of the injury. Oh boy. It's just Six, a stun. Six seven. Stun. Okay. Yep. And D eight two where the ball goes. Five goes Five. to there. Okay. That's not helpful. He still got his uh, angry uh, yeah, oh, sorry, yeah. emoji there. Sorry. <laughs> emoji. <laughs> <laughs> that is not good because I can block Penelope. One dice though. But but well, the the problem is I can block Penelope, but I can't move afterwards. No. If you want to get someone there, you're gonna have to dodge out Zog to get over there. If you want to try and get someone over there, and even yeah. then, yeah, you want to dodge past Creantra as well. Hmm. Hold on. Actually, I think I can go for the right here. One. Hold on. I gotta. I gotta be able to see the grid. One, two. God damn it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'd need. You I'd can at least mark it, but yeah, you would need to go for at it. At least one go for it, if not two. And and, it, well, yeah. one in a dodge or two go for it. Yeah. Uh. Okay. Well, let's. All right, let's go, Zog. Uh, need to dodge out. Three plus. Yep. Got that it. is. All right, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. What do we roll first? Okay, you <laughs> the dodge, dodge, or dodge, the dodge first. All right, what are we looking at? For three that one? three uh, plus. Okay. Nope. So he goes down. No re -roll. Okay, so armor roll first foe. Yep. Uh, that is through. Ah, Injury. Come on. That is a KO. KO. Fuck! And then D8, uh, he still hit the square, so D8 is where the ball gets bounced to. Yep. Four is off the pitch. Yes. Gets thrown yep. back in. I'll do the, the throw-in. Sure. So it goes right. Going the right way for you, Omer. Five squares. One, two, three, four, five. And then it bounces. I apologize for my outburst. That was a bit uh, bad. One. <laughs> All right. <sighs> oh, you can start turn three or turn nine. All right. Now I'm down to five fucking players. And I got nobody I can throw in either. All my people are used up. Well, I only had the one extra body anyway. Okay. This was, um, not, this was not what how it was supposed to. It was supposed to be your people leaving the pitch. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, uh, I have apothecary, gonna... don't I? Uh, you do. Do you, do you want to apothecary? Are you happy to have? Yeah. Him? yeah wait, Sorry, foe hammer. I've just realized. Yeah. I, I've just yeah. remembered. On a four plus. Uh, four plus. There yes. We go. Okay. So he's actually. Yep, so he stays. He in st stays right there. there but he's stunned. stunned. Yep. Yep. Yeah. And then the other guy okay. that was stunned last round turned over. Him, he's good. Yep. Okay. Sorry right, about that, Fulhammer. Yep, no worries. Stand up, Samopoli. Um, but that does use up my apothecary for the, for it the does, game, yeah. does it not? It does, yes. Okay. So, so I guess technically you could, you could change your... With these, with these armor rolls. I know. Yeah. I'm usually the one that's getting the armor rolls. 
All right, I'm going to declare a blitz with synopathy, uh, synopathy onto Hef. So okay. I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five to there, six yep. for the blitz. Two dice. So that'll be two dice. Got him. Got him. All right, we're just going to move him this way. Follow up. Amaral. Yep. No, not through. Not through. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to declare handoff with triple light. Yep. So one, two, three plus pick up. Three plus. Got it. Got it. Two, three, four, five, six. Three plus handoff. Uh, where's that? Oh wait, he's in range. That's a. Uh, uh no, 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 it's no, it's just. It's, uh, oh no, that that's the logo for that. This guy here, Sorry. yeah, it's that guy, yeah, right yeah, yeah. I, I saw the green there, and I saw the. the yeah. I yeah, I started thinking too, and then realized nope, no, no, yep. no, that's yep. not the right, that's not the right, <laughs> not the right guy. So three plus yep. handoff, right. three plus catch. Got it, got it, Christ. and I'm just gonna run in for the score. Okay, by well, Sophia, yeah, so I just record a lineman. Yeah, score. how do I record that in? Uh, you can still you just go. <laughs> you just pick a lineman. Oh, sorry, a journeyman. So. They have they have numbers on their yeah. on their bases. Yeah, what number? The numbers. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. But it might not be might not be All what right. that play number it in to a play though. So just either is fine. Okay, I'll just that's, do because like, that's what I did. That's what I did with that sent off guy earlier. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just do fifteen then. All right. Uh, come on. There we go. Okay. It's All recorded. right. So, Foe, you're setting up to kick off. Yep. Ready comments in Discord? Are anyone watching there? I don't even want to look at Discord right now. <laughs> I don't even want to look at it. Yeah, I usually uh, put it on mute anyway, just, you know, so it's not like constantly like pinging or whatever during matches. I have, right, I have plenty up. I have plenty on my table right now to pay attention to. I don't need to be there. Yeah. This, but I got plenty to freaking consider here. Uh, well, probably can't win now. You might be able to still tie it you, up, you, you know, what happens, uh, but... Uh, I'm the, the main thing is that you can still do here what you came to accomplish. You can still murder my players. We'll see. They're they are a bit <laughs> slicker than I was right. expecting. Are you set up now, Emma? I am. I am set up. Where are you kicking the ball to? Right. Big surprise, right behind the uh, minotaur. All right. Deviate roll. All right. Six to seven is off the, off the pitch. All right. Two to six for kickoff event. Is a brilliant coaching. So D six plus three, Omar. That's an eight. D six plus zero. Oh, you can't win. So yeah. Omar gets a reroll, and then Omar, you can choose who to give the pl the ball to. Uh, Jesus Christ. Uh, okay. Long arms gives me or plus, extra plus, arms plus one plus one to catch and pick catch up the ball. Pick up. And I believe it gives me safe hands too. I think. I uh, no, wrong. no, that you're thinking of. Uh, no, monstrous that's monstrous mouth. mouth. Monstrous yeah. mouth yeah. Yep, you're right. You're right. And then long legs that gives me leap or something plus, like that. It gives you plus one to leap attempts and plus one to intercept the ball. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's give it to full. Full. Okay. And you can now start turn nine into a play. Got four turns to score, twice. Yep. Yeah. It's no pressure. Three times for the win. Yeah. <laughs> no pressure. Uh, I'm just going to lead off with a blitz. I'm going to smack Hippolyte with the Minotaur. Okay, so, so I'm Channel Fury. Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know why I keep forgetting that, because I know it's there. It's not like I, I'm a new player. You, you know what I mean? Go for it to get in front of her. Yeah. Uh, that's not the button I wanted to push. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, and go okay, for it to hit good. her. Uh, 
God, all these go for it's and shit. Oh, yeah. come on! You want to use that fresh reroll? I'll be on a four plus though because of um his uh, loner. Yeah, I was gonna say I have to roll a four plus and then reroll, but yeah, we're gonna use it. No, okay. So nope. he goes down. I'm gonna roll there, foe. All right. If you kill my Minotaur, I'm gonna. That's oh, armor gosh. injury. That's a, that's a KO. Has he, got, KO. Has, he got, has, he got, has he got thick skull? He has thick skull. Yes, he does. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you can start so, your turn. In. Go ahead and, and roll your series of go for and whatnot <laughs> to blitz my ball carrier. <laughs> Bounce the ball closer to your oh, end zone. Fly Sirius got stripped ball next... too. So. Oh, yeah. that's even better. Even better. Yep. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Um. So, yeah. just. Oh, I promise I'm not mad at you. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> It, yeah, it's it's just the dice roll. At it's least at least you can't get, you can't get you can't get better than than a one dice uh blitz on your board carrier at least. Yep. Uh, yeah, no one else can get there without go for it. Um, okay, yep, that's just what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a one die, um, blitz onto uh the ball carrier. All right. So, so be, uh, be I think for I it. have to do a go for you it. Do yeah. It. Do you have? To? Oh yeah, you need one to make the go um, to, to make the blitz. Right. Actually, I can't do a. Um, no matter which way I go, you won't be able to do a hit and run. Yeah, so. hit and run. Yep. Right, so go, uh, for go for it. Yep. One dice. Okay. One die. Push. Oh, I strip ball. Yep. Okay. So, so first off, are you following? Um. Yeah, I will follow up. Okay, let's see if you check put... where the ball gets stripped strip from the square he was in or the square he goes to strip ball. I'm pretty sure it's stripped from the uh where he ends up. Yeah, where it's pushed so... back where it's pushed back into. That's it. Okay, so then yep. roll the eight, see where it goes. Was that because you eight. so so no matter what, that ball was coming out of his hands. Unless, unless I rolled a skull. Unless you um, a skull. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Jesus Christ. Okay. Sorry. No, I just <laughs> No, it, it, listen, you're doing everything you're supposed to be doing in order to win this game, and you're winning, so I'm not mad at you. I'm just I'm getting frustrated with the results that I yeah. can't control. Which All is right, and last ammo. thing is we're just going to do a foul. Yep. Hit the light, uh, hit the light onto yep. the... Plus, plus three. Oh. Yep. Uh, 2d6. Yep. Uh, six. Plus three. Oh, my gosh, my mouse is lagging so bad. Okay, uh, plus three is not through. Uh, even, nope, that is even, not even through. With, even with um, even plus, uh, plus four would actually no, would yeah, go through. Plus four would, it would be. be yeah, yeah, so, yeah, so, so I do. Yeah, normal, so normal, normal plus... injury. Yep. Oh, that's oh, a God. seriously Fucking hurt. God. So that's both. Uh, you use your pop carry already. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, thick skull doesn't bring that. Doesn't reduce the injury. Does no, it? it's only no. on uh, chaos. No, so yeah. a foul. Yeah. Uh, he's so out that's, next game. So it's a foul and a um, uh, casualty for Hippolyte. Now, do yep. you have this thing where all you play to regeneration, Omar? No, I think the only regeneration I had was uh, what's his name? The that troll I had. Okay, so you don't you don't have the um the the mercenary sorry the um necromancer move which oh. gives you. No, I never got that one. Okay, cool. Uh, so got, Omar uh, records the injury, right? Yeah, so Omar, you need to record an injury then of 11 on Minza. Yeah. Oh, that's going to fuck me up for next week, too. Oops, I forgot to put the injury in. There you go. God and damn. you haven't recorded the, record the casualty yet, Fo? I haven't recorded the casualty? Yeah. Yeah, you need you, for the... But the one that caused the injury. Yeah, you recorded the, you recorded the foul, but not the casualty. Oh, I didn't record. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah. So that is uh, casualty for Hippolyte. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. All right. And that's, All right, that's it, the end it, of my turn. Okay. So. Yep. Omar, turn ten. Mm-hmm. And there's uh, really feeling like there's not a whole hell of a lot. Yeah, of you, you got a, but you got a few two dice blocks here. Yep. Well, I mean, as far as the game, like there's yeah. no way I'm gonna. I don't, I don't foresee winning here, or even tying it. Rather, yeah, I don't even think you have enough time to be even be able to tie right now. No, but you can score still. Yeah, I think you unless we get work. lucky with a score and yeah, a timeout or something. Uh, two block, two die block on centipede with. Uh... <laughs> well, if you do it with rug, you can get the you can get the follow up potentially with rim. 
Yeah, let's yeah, add that. Rock. Yep. Keep getting that little bit right there. Okay, so if you push her to there, you then get with rim two dice as well. Yep, two dice with rim. Just a push. So one of these three. And get her out of my way. Uh, he will follow up. And then so the dog would have two dice on Smeopoly. Uh, you mean half? Uh, no, Hef would only get one dice because Zog is marked. Oh, gotcha. gotcha. But Zog has yeah. the unmarked uh, yeah. assist yeah. from Hef. Yeah. 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 All right, so two dice on that one. Got her. That's a pal. Knock her back there. You want to follow up? Uh, mm, mm, yeah. Armor roll? <clears throat> Nope. Which gives you two dice with Foal on Fysera. Push has to go there. I think, yeah, I think, we're, both trying, I think <laughs> we're both trying to move it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, he is not going to follow up. And then um, Hef come back to grab the ball. Two it's plus. Two. Yep, he's got the yeah, ball. Right. And then... I haven't shit I haven't blitzed yet, but that's fine. Um... One go for it. Yep. And I don't actually. I don't know why I went that far out, but because he's quite unprotected. But that's it. That's all I got. I'm okay. not gonna go for a second one. All right. And that's all of my players. Yep. Bo, turn eleven. Turn eleven. Well, uh, I'll stand up. Sumapoli. Um, one, two, three to there. Um, I'll declare a blitz with Krianta onto half the ball carrier. Yep. So let's go two one, days. two, three, four. Five to there. That'll be two dice. Yep, six for the bit. You sure you want to blitz from there? Oh no, never mind. The other one's oh, marked. Double skull. We plan I'm going to use my manager ability to. Yep. Uh, we plan for this. Uh, yep, I planned for this. Knew this was coming. Got him. And got him. Yep. So, it's there. Follow up. I'm a roll. Uh, uh, That's not through. Okay. Yeah, so the ball goes. Five is the sideline. Yep. Okay. Um, how many was that? Uh, that was six. Yeah. Okay, so that was six to there. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm going to move uh, Penelope. One, two, three, four to there. Um, she hasn't, hasn't gone yet. Uh, I'll do a block with uh, Snapathy onto Ruck. Yeah, Ruck. That'll, that'll be two dice. You got the assist yep. from Melby. Push. Just a push. Uh, we will push. Which way do I go? Um, let's push this way. Now follow up. Um, I'll do a block. It'll be a one die block. I'll do a block with some apathy. Who, who stood, who oh, stood no, up? Oh, no, she stood up. She stood yeah. up. That's right. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Yeah, it's um, unless, well, unless last thing Hippolyte is just a Hippolyte. Yep. yep. I'm actually going to try to pick up the ball with Hippolyte. So that'll go one, two, three, 
four. Oops, come on. Six. Five, six. six. Yep, yep, three plus. Yep, got it. Got it. You could declare a foul, too. Um, oh, yeah, I could have declared a foul, but yeah. Okay, because picking up the ball is an um, action. Yep. Uh, can I still declare a foul? No, you got to declare it, but your activation. Oh, you got to declare it at the beginning, yeah. Well, plus then, even now that I picked up the ball, even if you could, that would be a turnover if she got... Uh, well, it would be a turnover anyway, but uh, I could lose the ball then. I'm going to do a go for it to go yep. there, though. I just don't want her to be on the sideline. Three plus. Um, yep. She's good. Got it. Okay, that's my turnover. All right. MR, turn 11. Uh, I can stand up half, yes? Uh, yeah, you can. Right. Stand up half. Start turn 11 into a play, too. Oh, yep. Uh, let's see. One, two. Christ. One, two, three. Blitz with uh, what's his face here? Fall onto Hippolyte. Yep, two dice. You might as well use Pro to re-roll the skull. Uh, yeah. Yep. Uh, uh, three plus. Three plus on a d6. Yep. So just roll one. Just roll one blocking dice now. Okay, so it's still a push regardless. Still a push. Yep. yep. I'm going to push her back and then follow up. You could knock her off the pitch here, but it would just be a one die block. But no, because he was. With, he, he had, no, he half, stand I up. stood up half. Oh, that's right. I, yeah. I keep forgetting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There, there needs to be a way that I have. Uh, I, was, yeah. I was hoping for a knockdown. <laughs> yeah. I really needed a knockdown. Uh, yeah. Now I just got to figure out which I mean, one of these. What you could do is you could, have, you could have Rim. Block sympathy with one dice, and uh, hopefully either just a push or whatever, and, and follow up. And then you could have ruck block cramped with one dice and chain push to push somebody else in a polite way. Okay, starting with rem, two dice or one. One That's dice on One die. All right, we're gonna do this chain push thing. Okay, so you push okay. her to there. Yeah. And you follow, follow up, which now means that and... ruck's got one dice on Creanta. And also you can now, push. then what you do is you push Got it. Hep to there, to there, and to there. Okay. Now it's a big mess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and well, more importantly, I've got people in his fucking way from annoying me with yet another <laughs> uh, Zog. And I feel like that's going to be a one die down. It'd be two dice down in either case. Yeah. Two dice down, yeah. Yeah, yeah never mind. Uh, to dodge out. Three plus so here. Three, three plus to go there. Yeah. So okay. So three plus. Down he goes. Nope. Should I just fucking left him there? I'm a roll. Oh. Yep. Not through. All right. Final turn, foe. All right. Um. I am. Start into a play. Oh yeah. 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 You need to do that. Okay. Um, I'm going to declare a handoff with Hippolyte onto Fisera. So three plus dodge out. Three plus with a reroll. With a reroll. With a reroll. Got it. All right. That's one, two, three, four, five, six to there. Three now plus. Be a three plus catch. Hand off is that guy one, two. Yeah, he's, he's yeah, you're good. He's out of yeah, he's out of range. Hanging in the air. Come on. Got it. Got it. All right, and I'll just run Fisier in for another touchdown. All right. All right, record the touchdown. Yep. Touchdown, Pricera. Omar still gets one turn to try and get an XP. Yep. Try from, to kill somebody. Yep, from uh, he's only got one XP so far for playing. Yep. Yep. Set up to kick off. Yep. Oh. That was uh, Pricera's first score of the game. Yep.
All right, I am set up. Right, and set up to receive. Bye bye. I'm set. All right, where are you okay. kicking the ball to? No surprise, right there. All right, deviate roll. And deviate. Two to six, one, two, and kick off event. Nine is a quick snap. So D3 plus one of Omar's players can make a move. Uh, let's see. Two players two. Can, can move one square. I will make these two move one square. And... In the ball bounces, I, you know what? You know what? I don't know why I moved those two right there, but fuck it, it's too late. <laughs> I got confused which icon on the table was the ball. I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh, so it goes to there. All right. Oh, so that managed to work out for me anyway. So you can start your final turn, Omar. Yep. Uh, I don't even care about the ball. <laughs> I just don't care about the oh, ball. Yeah, you, you, you could, you could for a, a pass. I could throw a pass. Good. That's about it. Yeah, yeah. It would, it'd be a four plus pass. I think there, there are a four plus pass. Yeah, three plus catch. And a handoff doesn't count. As no, far as a, has, to, has to be yeah, a pass. So it has to be a pass. But pass. I mean, what, what you would do is you would have so, you have fall throw the pass to. Um, yeah, one of these to, guys with to Hef. Yeah, that's right. Which gives you yeah. best chance of getting the point. And why fall? Because, because he's got oh, because he's got pro. He's going to re-roll yeah. fail the pass. But but if you're going to do a blitz first, do the blitz first because that's going to be a two dice blitz. Yeah. Uh, fuck it. We're going to blitz. What's her face right there? All right. I just so, looked at it. Sophia. So one dice. So it's a it's a two plus go for it. From hold on. Oh, but I need a two plus. Yeah, yeah. to go to, into just to actually hit the blitz. Oh, oh god me. There you go. Jeez. Roll, roll, I'm a foe. All right. That's not through. That is the At end least of the match. it's not through. Yep. Oh, what a rough in the match. I am so sorry, Omar. Thassa will not be giving a post game interview. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, he is absolutely fucking livid right now. I am very upset, but. Oh, I want you. I need you to understand. I am not uh, mad at you. Oh yeah, yeah, anyway. I get it. I get it. Fuck me, man! What a horrible. Sh I started on such a high with this match because yeah, you... of how much of an advantage I had over your team. Yeah. Just to have right. every little bit of it eroded by like the second turn in the second half, every bit of it eroded. All right. So end your turn into a play, and then both of you to end of match. Okay, let me get rid of team quitters. Thank you. Oh, that's going to be something weird. Graphics glitch with uh, two of play. Let me fix, try and fix this again. Then a match report. Oh, well, wow. It has Basir quitting the team. Well, she, or, she'll automatically quit because she auto quit. quits. Yeah, because yeah. she's got And Hippolyte. And Savy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck off, Kadia. Yeah, I don't know why it makes players that weren't at the game even try and quit. All right, so um, first off, we need to do a D6 roll for um, uh, for fan factor. So, foe, it's winner, roll D6. You need yep. a five or six for it to go up. Nope, so you can record a three. Uh, Omar, roll okay. a D6. You don't, you want to roll, don't want to roll a one or a two. I, say, I thought I pushed the button. There you go. You can put four in there and that'll stop. That'll, uh, Okay. Um, all right. So next up, it's going to be the draft. So yep. players that can be drafted on your side, foe, not by Sarah, because she is a. Um... Oh, no one, because I have the uh, the legendary. Oh, legendary playbook. Sorry, that's right. Yeah, playbook. Yep, where no one can be drafted. Um, for Omar, I think it's. Let's talk about which players actually picked up fresh skills. I think that Hef is one. I think disturbing presence was already there. Yeah, I think Claws was already on Zog. So uh, make mm -hmm. it... Make... Yeah, so, I think that's right. 
Yeah, Sorry, let me, go ahead. I'm gonna quickly check to make sure um, whether Hef already had one of those skills at the start of the season. Um, Rorders, Hef had uh, Hef had nothing, so he's picked up both yeah. skills this season. Yep, yep, that sounds right. Zog had nothing, so he's picked up claws this season. Uh, yeah. All had the seven pins already, um, and Rem was a new player this season, so he's picked up extra arms. Okay. Okay, so, that sounds right. So make a management roll. Uh, two d six. This will be plus two. Plus two. Okay, ten. Which means you, that's fine. You're immune from the draft. Cool. Excellent. All right, and then uh, skills. So, Fove, do you want to roll training? Uh, yeah. Let me. Uh, this is plus three. Yep. That's so three. you can basically pick. So a, I can basically pick... give a player yep. a skill. Yes. Yep. Um. Hmm. Let me, uh, actually, I think I'll just, um, I was thinking, yeah, I'll just give, uh, I want to give it to, um, I think I'll just give Kriantha block just to make her a uh, lodger. Okay. So just put Kriantha into, um, into tool play. Yep. Uh, Omar, make a training roll. Uh, plus one. So that's enough okay. to do you have um know the ropes or double guide by players i do not okay so you can at least you, you you have to roll for the table but you can pick the skill itself so who do you want to give a skill to uh let's go with uh shit, i don't even know full full okay yeah. okay what type of skill do you want to give him mutation all right so roll a d6 to see which table it's on Bottom table, so your choices are Ironheart skin, monstrous mouth, prehensile tail, tentacles, two heads, very long legs. So two heads is plus one to dodge. Um, ten yeah. Tentacles means that people dodging away from him are at minus one for their dodge rolls. No, so that's prehensile tail, sorry. Tentacles means... Um, There's a strength test involved in tentacles, if I remember right. I think so, yeah, to actually... Yeah, it's like a weird one where you have to like, you know, the it, it is, it, versus their yeah, strength, it's not just I a, think. it's not just a flat plus one minus one sort of thing. It's a weird, like strengths are compared and then somebody gets yeah, a bonus yeah, you roll, to roll, try to hold somebody down. Yeah, you roll a d6 and, um, yeah, apply strength, adding the strength of each player and the winner, if you win, they stop them from leaving. Uh, fuck. I, I'm sorry, James. Uh, can you run through the list one more time, please? Iron hard skin, monstrous mouth, prehensile tail, tentacles, two heads, very long legs. Let's go with two heads. Who are you giving it to? Full. Full. Okay. Um, monstrous mouth was the one that you were talking about earlier. That uh, yeah, I, it, it's a toss from, up. Uh, Actually, you know fall. what? Yeah, go. Let's go with two heads because uh, catching and and keeping the ball is one thing but i'm running in i'm i'm seeing more opportunities for dodge gotcha. coming up so that two heads minus one dodge okay. is uh sound like a better idea right so, now so we into a play just to random primary for fall and we'll fix it in a moment all right, all right and, and then i doubt i got yeah, for a sponsor well yeah you, you, you got you got to decline because you uh you rolled under seven on the uh, initial roll so, uh, what are your totals, not including the roll up to for sponsorship? I'm sorry, say that again. Uh, so, I'll, 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 I've got the sponsorship roll up on the screen for you right now. Oh, uh, in tour play, yeah. yeah. Uh, let me see. Uh, yes, as sponsorship. Okay, what is it? What is everything excluding the roll add up to? Excluding the roll, uh, so I got five for dedicated fans, another three for match. Uh, Another one for injuries, and then another three for touchdowns. Okay, so that's 12 total, plus two more because you yep. rolled well at the start, so plus 14. So roll a D16, and on a six or more, you get off another sponsor. All right. Hang on, sorry, my mouse keeps uh, lagging here. All right, uh, D16. Yep. No, so nope. <laughs> decline the sponsor. Um, Wow, you had such a uh, low roll. I fired my last sponsor, if I remember correctly. Um, so I don't have a sponsor right now. Oh, you don't? Okay, so um, I'll remove that one then. And I'll remove the 10,000 roll for you. Uh, yeah. Well, because it was the whole thing about uh, 
was, but, uh, you know, offended the sponsor and couldn't play. So, yeah, basically, I'm just going on uh, that uh, I don't have a sponsor right now, okay. but I will use my manager re -roll, trying to re-roll that. Okay, cool. Because I want to try to get another sponsor here. If this works. No. No, nope, Izzy works. No. Okay. <laughs> Where was this kind of like 40 fucking 30, 45 minutes ago? <laughs> okay. <laughs> because we fired our first sponsor because someone, you know, offended the sponsor. We fired our second sponsor. Everyone's like, nope. We're not sponsoring this team no more. All right, so decline, <laughs> decline it into a play. All right. <laughs> and then, okay, that's the match reported. So go into, your, go into your teams and roll the random skill, and we'll fix up the random skills on the two teams. <laughs> so, fix up that. Oh, she actually got block. Nice. I can do that. Ooh, I almost hit the fire button. All right, Fo, so you've got two hundred. Oh, I gave him two heads randomly. Nice ah! <laughs> for both of us. What's the right. of that? Well, you've got two hundred k to spend. Yeah. Um. I mean, there's not really much I can or I want to spend on, so I'm going to have to roll for uh, expensive, expensive mistakes. mistakes. Yes. Yeah, because I don't want to like up anything. I mean, I'm already giving away so much. Uh, Inducements. So what is it? Uh, D2D6? Six, no, 1D6, don't roll a 1 or a 2. All right. You're fine. All right. All right. Omar, you're on 155K. Yeah. How does that? I have to put 70K in the stadium fund to, get 50. to have 50K. Yeah. Right. And how much money do I need for a stadium? 250 total. All right. Uh... I mean, that being said, yeah. you because you, that's the only thing you want to put in the fund. If you want to, you can just spend... 150 from your treasury right now leave you with 5k and, and get a stadium straight away and what are the benefits to having a stadium again well you get the every time it's your home game you get to apply the benefits of your stadium depends what like for me it's the ale fueled maniac well, I, 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 yeah. yeah well i guess that, i guess that was the question is like oh so it, oh, sorry each stadium has different benefits yeah that that's right, right yeah and so the way it works is once, once you've got a fund for a stadium, if you haven't already gotten a stadium through as an offered stadium through the matches, you can then mm -hmm. make a promotion roll. And on a success, you can pick the type of stadium you want. On a failure, you can still roll a stadium. And if you like what you roll, you can then take that or you can keep the money and roll again next time. All right, let's 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 get a stadium. Okay. We, need to, we need some roots here because we're going to be here for another two more weeks plus another season okay so let me fix this there's a somehow of adjustments. somehow struggling to keep from losing all the fucking time no, i shouldn't say that i've only lost twice this season it's much better than last season. yeah it's actually this is your first game in a long time where you haven't scored like usually you do get at least one score in a in a match as yeah well, so. well you know Fohammer brought his disturbing presence of dice all right <laughs> make a make a promotion roll first off Homer. uh of course that's the one with no modifier Okay, Five. so it's going to be a random stadium to see what you get. So first off, it's a D, it's 2D, two, two D, uh, well, let's just do this. Um, roll a D8. Okay, so rough and ready stadium, then roll a D8 again. Eight. Eight. So you are offered a stadium with poorly built dungeons. Um, which means that um, <laughs> which, it's funny considering what happened yeah. on, on any any yeah. turn, any any at the end of any drive, any set of players that are in the sin bin get to return to the reserves box on a five plus. Okay. Do you want to keep? Was that the only? Was that the only? Yeah, option that's the only option. Yeah. So, so you, if you want to, you can wait until next game and try try again for a different stadium option. No, we'll go with that. Okay. We'll call it the uh, fuck faux hammer. Just <laughs> I'm just no, because that sounds like that's what the mercenary is. Like, oh, you know, I can get us out of here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. So and I want, and, and can, now, if, by taking the stadium, what weather comes with that? Uh, well, you or, when when, or it's, that... when it's your home game, you always get to choose standard weather, seasonal weather, or for, in your case, desolate wasteland. Oh, because of the chaos yep. or the chaos chosen or whatever. That's okay. Right, yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, let's take it. We'll call it the. I don't know. I'll think of some <laughs> smart ass name. Um, we'll, we'll call it the Crystal Ball Stadium. <laughs> so I'm sorry, I'm done, James. Go ahead. Final scene: Wilhelm sitting down with um, with Bungo in an empty chair. 
Yeah, that's exactly <laughs> what it is. Bungo in an empty chair. Yes. So, Bungo, it seems that you were right. History repeats itself. Right after losing a match to the Drakes, you uh, you beat the Marauders 3 0. Yes, yes. It uh, seems to happen a lot that way. You know, the, there was something in the 3 0, but, you know, um, the, uh, yeah, it, I, you know, it was a 3 0 last season. The, um, yeah, it's just, uh, History repeats itself. You know, it, it's, uh, oh, yes, it, it's the blessings of Rig. You know, come down to shine upon the guy. He's just going to be, like, full of shit and just, you know. Yes, it was so just lucky to be, not there yeah, right just, now. Yeah, exactly. That's why he pointed <laughs> it out. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm lightning sure if Fossa was here, he would say the same thing. That clearly, this team is blessed, and we are destined to make the playoffs and compete as championships i was thinking of a you know a catchy slogan for the repeat uh oh that's it yeah it's the repeat yeah there you go i gotta break this down <laughs> uh, gonna gesture to uh bash off screen you know, make sure you copyright that <laughs> <laughs> uh well congratulations that does put you at least temporarily back into first place although with the drakes and kodak's game that's still to play if one of them wins they will jump ahead into first place uh, and the Marauders managed to avoid being jumped by the Butchers. Um, one more point in your favor would have potentially seen the, uh, the corn team jump over the, uh, the Marauders, but, um, still in with a shot at the finals with a couple of matches still to play. So we'll have to see how that goes. Um, any final thoughts on the match there, Bungo? It was great to, uh, turn around from the devastating loss that we had against the, the Drakes last week. So. Hopefully this will help us rebound into a solid position for the uh, for the postseason, and th this has definitely been an interesting round, Wilhelm. You know, just the limitation of you know the linemen and just yeah, it, it whole lot of variables there. And I I think for our I'll, you know the one thing I think all the coaches can agree on is that it'll be nice to put this round behind us and not have to deal with so many weird variables going into our matches. Well, you need to definitely need to make sure that you keep up with your donations to the referees retirement fund because it certainly they certainly seem to go your way today. Yes, yes. Yeah, my own yeah, yeah, Bash a big note of that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Bungo, thank you for joining us tonight. And to our audience at home, thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed this match. I certainly enjoyed watching it. We'll be back soon for some more round six action from the Brew Bowl. Thanks for watching. And you guys, that was a that was a fun match to watch. It was a tough match to watch seeing uh, the, the the dice roll like just um like like fo it wasn't fo even just one or two rolls. It was consistently rolling against me. Yep. Yeah. Fo 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 falls apart when he rolls a two into a two all the time. Like every time he's like he's fo's got so many re rolls that when he tries to roll a three plus and he fails twice, that's where fo's plan starts to break down. But yep. that didn't happen yep. tonight. Every time every time you fail the first roll, you made the second roll, uh, and then Omar for you, yeah, just. Things like um, uh, the yeah, players getting sent off and everything. go so. for it on a blitz when I didn't have any better option than to just smack his players. I literally started, so I started off on a win from last last week or whatever you want to call it, last round. Yeah. To going into a match against a tough team that has a couple of key players out of the game to having a mercenary that honestly only barely did his job tonight, although in his defense, an apothecary caused part of that problem. Yeah to losing two players to not scoring shit to getting dumped on three times and then and at the final end minotaur. yeah and losing my minotaur not just for the rest of this game but next one as well thank you you son of a bitch <laughs> sorry <laughs> and it's just like oh my god like it, it i mean at this point you might as well throw the whole fucking stadium at my team just pick up the stadium and hulk <laughs> bash with that stupid thing look i i I, I I don't know who gave you was it Lord Hunger that gave you the advice to take the chainsaw Merc? I at this point I'm not going to reveal okay, who no Lord Hunger spoke to you about that. <laughs> okay, no worries. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was. It was. Yeah. And it would have worked. It would have worked. Like obviously I was writing on dice pro dice results, right? But if it was just losing one or two dice results, okay, no biggie. We still have a half decent game for both players. Yep. I had so many dice results, whether I threw them or Foe Hammer threw them. The dice just went against me consistently all night long. Yeah, yeah. I was even going to suggest that um, that you hold the chainsaw player until you, uh, a drive where you had the ball, and you did in the first in the first drive. That was fine, except for the fact that yeah, Fogo around the back and scored really quickly. So you only really yep. got three yep. turns 
with the chainsaw player. Yeah. Well, and we lost one turn right off the bat of the game too. Yeah, that's that it. didn't help any. Yeah, that just that put even more pressure on me to to do something with the scoreboard, and I just couldn't accomplish shit. Yeah. I never yep. saw the other side of the map of the pitch. By the way, not once. I barely made it across my own uh, starting area. Yeah. I can't yeah. remember what the lines are called. Well, I don't know if you watched the match the other day with with um, with uh, Pondo and um, Lawson, but I think at one point, like in, I think like turn ten, I said to Pondo, "Is that the first time one of your players has touched the ball?" And he's like, "Is it the first time one of your players has touched the ball?" Because it was. Oh yeah, I don't. I forget now because it was all you know more than thirty seconds ago. But Fullhammer, you said something, and I was like, "Me, me, me." I was like, "Nope, I'm not there. I can't say that." <laughs> Yeah, yeah yeah no it was just uh yeah the dice rolls were just rough and uh you know the i mean you definitely came in going into it what you know really anyone would do against amazons you know you want to injure them that that's like their biggest weakness is you know once you start to get those good injuries and of course the chainsaw you know leads into that but then the counter thing that i've learned to do from that is you know try to put a lot of pressure on and if you can score and make them roll to keep that secret weapon on the pitch, which has happened before. I mean, there was, I forgot who it was. It was probably against Lawson, but <laughs> somebody just Lawson. like kept their chainsaw on like, on the pitch, like the whole game, you know? And uh, you saw, like, I mean, I you saw me, guy. I tried to, I tried to keep every advantage I could. I just nothing, yeah. worked. nothing. Like, I don't want to sound like the guy that's bitching about how nothing. No, no, way, it's just, literally yeah, nothing went my way. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, you can't control the dice rolls, you know? And it's one of those things that you, then you're just responding to all the, you know the situations that the dice rolls set up and it's just yeah i mean and, i again i see this happen a lot i don't think you really did anything wrong and setting up that uh that like <laughs> that uh mega cage at the beginning it's just like i mean there's you know i didn't want to dive into that and i knew that's what you wanted me to do and it's just like I, well, but I yeah once i got that ball free you know early it was just you know that's when it started going downhill because i had that cage i had a good cage all I had to do now was advance, advance, yeah. advance, advance, have a couple of outliers to fuck up your team and keep advancing into the end zone. And it just fell apart. Like I did yeah. once again, textbook, 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 fall apart, fall apart, fall apart. Yeah. But two, two different desperate measures could have quite changed things up too. Like you, the fact oh, that yeah. Yeah, yeah, they, 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 they weren't the best desperate measures for you. Yeah. Like, you know, yeah. something like, like banana peel, fireball, God, you know, oh, the fireball <laughs> would have been amazing on that cage that he had that i tightened it up for him yeah although well, not even fireball that. right on the ball carrier it's not even that actually a lot of the other coaches figured this out if you have the magic scroll one of the best things to do is to turn uh Fisira into a frog because then yep. she's out you know if you can get her out of the game you know yeah that's, the game. that's, that's it. huge yeah then. yeah yep. she's out for the rest of the match no pop carry yeah although, although way, she wasn't she wasn't clinched this game though i don't think um you know like so certainly certainly in that first drive Omar yeah. completely managed her with the chainsaw. Um, you know, she only she yeah she scored in the second drive, but only only from the back of a handoff. And yeah. and the time yeah. she had a chance to score with hit and run, that was that was contained enough that you had to throw it to somebody else in the end. Yep. So yeah. Yep. So one XP for me for yep. showing up, and six XP for Fo. Yep. Fuck you, Fo. I fucking hate you. <laughs> God damn it. But I got enough to get my next plus one, which I'm going to put it in the management. Yep. I don't. I'm not sure what I was thinking several weeks ago, but that's where it's gone. Plus three management now. Yeah, that'll definitely get me uh, up for something else. So I'll have to look to see like what is uh, available still in the. Uh, I think I can actually do the uh, the extra um, just just what I need another uh, manager reroll. <laughs> you know, yeah. just another reroll to throw out there when I usually don't use most of them on the game. <sighs> All right, guys. Thank you for playing. I appreciate it. And to the audience at home, thank you for watching. Um, there's still one more match to go. Dynamics match of the Drakes versus the uh, the Kodiaks, which should be a good match. I'm hoping should should uh, shake up the the leaderboard once more. Uh, otherwise, yep. but I think you're hoping for, you're praying for a um, for a draw there, Fo, so you can stay at the top of the table. <laughs> yep, definitely. But that, I think that either way, I think that's unlikely. You know, yep. it's yeah, it, it it's tough to go against the Drakes. Everyone knows that. You know, they can very quickly turn things around in their favor with just one or two players on on the pitch but you know it could also go uh into dynamis's way and you know just they're easy to injure you know just yep. get uh eight 
you know, plus on oh the my God. That was an, the stuff to fall apart. That was another thing. Like I realized I only needed eight plus, but I could not hurt any of your damn players. And you threw three or four. I don't know. It wasn't that many, but it felt like 15 people were thrown off my team. <laughs> yeah. yeah the, what, in, what the hell? In, injury favor definitely went, went for him his way there. So. Oh yeah, absolutely. It did. Yep. Absolutely. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. And uh, we'll see you next time here on, uh, on YouTube.